Today we're going to demonstrate how to create a fully responsive email in under 10 minutes using one of Graphic Mail's fully responsive templates. The template we've chosen today is a two column layout as you can see here as this best suits the needs of the email that we've chosen to create. Ok so let's get started. First thing we're going to do is remove the top section, the top content block. Do that by hovering over the cross in the top right hand corner and click and remove block. Right, next we're going to add our header image. We've got our, all our images and content all saved in a, in a text document ready to use. So we just clicked on image on the left hand side after we clicked on the image and now we're going to upload our image. Just click on browse and then select the header image and once that uploads we just simply press done and that will insert the image into the template. Next we want another image underneath this one so we hover over the content block again, click the plus and that duplicates it underneath. We, using the same method as before we click on the image, click image on the left hand menu and this will bring up the dialog box click on upload images and we will select our hero image and again once that uploads we just simply press done and we can start to add our content so the first lot of content is going to go into this block here so we go into our text document and we select the header control and C on the keyboard to copy it and highlight the text right click and press paste. This will bring up a dialog box. You just paste it into there, that removes any of the formatting, and just press OK. Same as we did with the images, we're going to duplicate this content block. So we click the plus underneath to copy the copy the content block and copy our code from our text document. I hover over that, press paste and paste the pin into there and press OK. So that's our content done. So what we're going to do is we're going to change the image in this two column layout here. So the same again, we click on the image, click image on the left hand menu, click upload and find our image which is the free trial image there. And click done. The right, difference with this image is we want it to be smaller than it's appeared. So we click on the image, which will open the image properties at the top there, and we change that to 120 pixels, which automatically changes the height in proportion, and we are going to center align it. Next, we're going to add the heading for this section, which is Start Your Free Trial. Let's paste that into this section, like so and then the content underneath. Let's highlight that, right click and paste and paste it in. You can see there's a button placeholder there and that is just a placeholder as we will be going into the code of this content block and pasting in the button which we've made using our button creator which we will link to in the description box below and right now we're just adding the other image to the right hand side and we click done. Same again, click on the image, change it to 120 pixels wide and centrally align it. Let's get the heading which is sign up to a plan. Let's click in that box there and paste that in and let's copy the content. and paste. Okay, These sections here, we don't need them, so we're just, again we're just going to hover over and click on the cross in the right hand corner and click remove block. Same again for this two section and for this line also. We do want another bit of content below, so we're going to hover over this, click the plus at the bottom to duplicate it use the move handler and drag it down beneath the two section and we go back into our notepad and get the content for the bottom. 
copy that highlight over the content that's already there right click and paste and paste it in the dialog box excellent right we have got some footer text which we're going to copy and paste into this section here let's right click and paste and there we go Okay, in this section we're going to add some social share icons so what we're going to do is remove the text click on social click on facebook click from the drop down menu and click share your newsletter we're just going to choose a small one today and press insert so that's inserted that there if you want to right click here we're going to add a twitter one also so let's go to columns and then insert column after let's press right on the keyboard to get into that cell and click on Twitter and share your newsletter via Twitter let's click the same size and press insert and there you go that's inserted that the last thing we're going to do is we are going to style the newsletter now we'll work from the top down so first of all we will set the background of the newsletter so we click on styles on the left and click on background again I've got the background color we want to use in the notepad so we're just going to copy the hexadecimal code and paste it into that box there let's change it to dark grey then the header we are going to highlight it centrally, ali centrally align it change it to 24 pixels make it bold and change it to a nice green colour so click on the colour drop down paste in the hexadecimal code like we did the background now we have it we are going to make this heading stand out so we're going to put it to bold and change the colour to the same green as the main heading and then into this content block the headings we are going to make 18 pixels in size we're going to centrally align them and we're going to make them bold same again for this one like so now we're going to paste in the buttons so that is the code for the left hand button so what we're going to do is we're going to click content block at the top and then click HTML I'm going to press Ctrl and F on the keyboard type in button let's highlight the first instance of button I'm going to copy over that and paste and then we're going to find the next instance of button which is the le the right hand side sorry and let's copy that and paste it over the text which says button and just simply press update and you can see the buttons have appeared This last section is the footer which we are going to press bold and bold the email and the Twitter the telephone sorry and the website address and there we have it a fully responsive template ready to send out to your subscribers made in under 10 minutes using graphic mail thank you for watching goodbye